Hi, it's me, Flo or Flowchart, and welcome back to another video, where today we are once again doing the advent calendar. It is day four and continuing the countdown. There are 21 days until Christmas and 27 until the new year. Please leave a like and subscribe as it really helps the channel out and leaves a smile on my face, though you won't be able to see it, well, because mask. Today's Christmassy topic is carols. Now, carols are something that you either love or hate or kind of just really don't give a shit about. <laughs> They're not something that everybody likes and that's fair enough. They can get quite annoying as they are very catchy um, in music terms. They have a riff, uh, which uh, can be quite annoying, such as deck the halls with boughs of holly, fa la 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly, fa la 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 la. Um, <laughs> sorry, you're gonna have that stuck in your head for the rest of the day. Um, caroling was originally a tradition passed down from generation to generation. They commemorate the nativity and were first written in latin in the fourth and fifth centuries well originally they commemorated the nativity only they did actually become associated with christmas until the 13th century which i find quite funny that we've taken yet another um religious tradition and turned it into some capitalist thing but i guess they're kind of good because they're these tunes that everybody knows and can feel involved in creating a sense of sort of community i guess even though we're not all from the same religion or the same background we all kind of mutually sing these songs they're sung in primary school and it's quite nice especially when they sing the non-religious ones when they sing the non-religious ones that's that's good because then it's like actually something that everybody can celebrate because obviously you know there are a lot of non-christian people who exist and it's difficult for them to relate to it when it's something so religious i one of my favorites is fairy tale of new york just because it's so kind of playful it's it's got a very sad message but it's it's fun and enjoyable to listen to and try and join in on and obviously fail but it's fun i also um used to love no actually no i didn't love it at all i hated it it made me really sad because i could i could hear the emotions and it made me sad it was last christmas i gave you my heart and the very next day you gave it away this year to save me from tears i'll give it to someone special let's hope that doesn't get uh copyright claimed let's hope that ha doesn't happen thankfully i don't think it will um because i'm not that well known but yeah thank you for watching i hope you're having a wonderful morning day or evening however you are wherever you are and i hope you're doing well if you are not then my dms are open though don't feel pressured to talk to me as that is not what i wish to do please leave a like and subscribe as it always means a lot and it makes me quite happy i hope you've enjoyed and let me know what some of your favourite carols are as well. And what carols you absolutely hated. Or, if you completely hated them, just talk about some of your favourite songs down in the comments and I'll go and have a listen. I'll see you next time. Bye!